There's a scandal afoot. A head of state scandal. One of the best kinds. But before those exclamations lead you down a triggered path of my god, not another scandal please, know that no one else in the White House was fired. It has nothing to do with the condition of mattresses in certain hotel rooms west of Siberia, sorry. There are no illegal substances involved. It is this, the Trudeau family really is doing the most, and, boy, people are talking. Doing the most means exactly what you think it means. It's one of those elegantly efficient phrases that the young ones are always thinking up and spreading around. It means doing more than necessary, betraying a complete and total lack of chill and ability to read the room. It is Donald Trump's taste in interior decorating. It is the lead of this piece. It is an essential anti rahana ness It is Justin Trudeau most of the time, and especially right now. Trudeau and family have traveled to India on an official Canadian visit this week and have each been wearing, to every appointment, traditional Indian clothing commissioned from top designers in the nation. That sounds great. Fashion diplomacy, baby. Like Michelle Obama touching down in Delhi wearing Bibhu Mohapatra or Kate Middleton playing sports in Mumbai wearing Anita Donger. Fashion diplomacy is only ever somewhat notable when it goes right, but it's possible that Trudeau's are doing it to right. As Omar Abdullah, the former chief minister of the North Indian state of Jammu and Kashmir, put it on Twitter, is it just me, or is this choreographed cuteness all just a bit much now? Also Fiwi Indians don't dress like this every day sir, not even in Bollywood. It's really became obvious that they had done more than most at a dinner with Bollywood actors on Tuesday night. Trudeau's wife, Sophie, wore a cream sari, his daughter, Ella Grace, wore a lehenga choli, his sons, Xavier and Hadrian, wore a pajama kurta set, and Trudeau himself wore an elaborate sherwani. Guests like our Madhavan, Shahrakh Khan, and Amr Khan wore, I don't know, pants. There seem to be two arguments here about Trudeau's choice for the evening. Point counterpoint It's a little over the top, confessed Vivek Dahijia, an economics professor in Ottawa, to Canada's Global News. I understand on day one having to wear the traditional clothes, but now it's getting too much. But listen, this is a particular kind of nightmare with which many will be familiar. You dress up for a party, wear something nice, a tailored three-piece, perhaps, or long gown and heels. But you arrive to find a room full of jeans and tees and, Christ, are those new balances? One of these days I'll figure out what dressy casual means you promise yourself before committing fully to the shrimp cocktail. But this is different. A political family should be able to move within other cultures without setting off some kind of cross-continental fashion emergency. Presumably the Trudeau gang has stylists who determine the appropriateness of clothing for a living. It's their job to match clothing appropriateness. But anyway, the world is generally consumed with much more pressing scandals, and at the end of the day, Trudeau would not be Trudeau unless he was going above and beyond and into outer space and around the farthest reaches of the universe and back to Canada. He really is the most.